Sometimes, animals pick on smaller or weaker animals because they think it's going to be easy. However, they don't always get the result they hope for. Sometimes, the weaker animal shows a lot of resilience and surprises the stronger one. If you like underdogs and want to see them triumph like never before, keep watching as we count down 15 moments when animals mess with the wrong opponents. Number 15. American Badger vs. Dog Badger behavior varies by family, but they all live underground in burrows called sets. Badgers are ferocious creatures who will go to any length to protect themselves and their young. Badgers can fight off much larger animals, such as dogs. This white dog threatens a badger that has encroached on his property. The dog is barking, but not attacking the badger. The badger is cornered but stands its ground. When the dog tries to bite it, the badger goes on the offensive and the dog backs down. The dog's handler approaches with a net, trying to capture the badger so he can get him out of there. The fight continues and includes a few close combat scuffles, but nothing more. These Dashuns are aggressing this badger, but the badger is well protected, with his back sitting between two logs. There isn't much the dogs can do besides bark. This Rhodesian Ridgeback gets more than a bargain for when confronted with a much smaller badger. In the face of much larger and stronger animals, badgers are unrivaled in their bravery, aggressiveness, and fearlessness. They'll fight back, and for the most part, prevail. The Fanatic brings you all the best content you want to see when it comes to the animal kingdom. If you want to see the latest confrontations between animals and the best animal videos, please subscribe now. We post new videos every day for your entertainment. Number 14. Pitbull Watch this crazy pitbull run full speed ahead and smash into this buffalo. I feel bad for the dog, but man was that hilarious. The dog bounced off the buffalo like a super ball. Pit bulls can do a lot of damage to many animals, but for a beast like this buffalo, the pit bull is like an annoying cockroach. This pit bull sees a deer in his driveway, and a deer is nothing compared to a buffalo. But this pit bull still knows it's wiser to keep his distance, even though he's tempted to approach the deer. Surprisingly enough, the deer isn't afraid of the dog and stands her ground. This pit bull watches a herd of buffaloes, but not for long when one of the beasts comes running for the dog. Number 13. Cat vs. Octopus Cats are very curious animals, and it is not often that they encounter an octopus. So when this cat sees this octopus strolling on a dock, it is curious as to how tasty the octopus is. The cat lightly bites the octopus and tries to play with its tentacles, while the octopus knows exactly where the water is and tries to get there as soon as possible. The octopus has finally arrived at its destination and is safely back in the water. What just happened, says the cat. I say, what in God's name was an octopus doing taking a stroll on a dock? In the following video, a cat owner enjoys feeding live octopus to his cats, but the octopus doesn't always want to be served for lunch. So it sometimes grabs onto the cat's face and plays with it. I'm sure it feels fantastic. This cat appears to be wearing a mask. In our next video, a cat sits and watches as an octopus emerges from its hole to bask in the sun. The cat is perplexed as to what is going on and eventually decides not to bother with whatever that slimy thing is. It says to the octopus, see you later alligator, and the octopus tries to persuade the cat that it is not an alligator. Another cat is attempting to eat an octopus alive, but the octopus completely covers the cat's face until a man grabs the cat and releases the octopus. Number 12. Horse vs. Rooster A raucous rooster can be as annoying as a dog that barks incessantly. If you live in a more densely populated area, your neighbors may be equally frustrated. A loud rooster can disrupt your neighbor's sleep if they work at night and sleep during the day. Ask these horses if they think the rooster is in the following clip is annoying. Roosters are relentless little pests who aren't afraid of much, but they can't compete with a horse. However, the rooster in our first video believes it can. The chicken keeps sneaking up on the horse from behind, and the horse tries to kick it hard in the nuggets. But the chicken keeps coming back. This chicken is similar to a poodle biting at the person's feet and not letting go. What a pain in the backside. This chicken annoys and harasses the horse to the point where the horse falls to the ground and nearly squashes the chicken. Perhaps it could have been a good thing. The same rooster is training another horse, 
but I'm not sure if it's good for the horses. They appear to be irritated by this rooster. Number 11. Shrew versus Scorpion The desert shrew feeds on a variety of arthropods, lizards, and even small mice. It feeds on scorpions and appears to be immune to their sting. Every day, shrews consume up to 75% of their body weight in food. Scorpions are venomous predators, but this scorpion has met its match in the form of this psychotic shrew. Even though the scorpion strikes a karate kid pose on the shrew, it has no effect on the animal and the scorpion is quickly destroyed. Another psycho shrew easily dispatches of a scorpion and after some deliberation decides to eat it. This desert shrew stalks and ambushes an unsuspecting scorpion. It grabs the scorpion's stinger and drags it back a few inches, crushing the stinger in the process. The shrew then consumes the dead insect. Number 10. Leopard vs. Porcupine Leopards will hunt and kill porcupines if they must, but they know how painful and tedious it can be, so if they can avoid it, they will. One of Africa's most beautiful felines is the leopard. This leopard hasn't had much luck hunting lately and is on the verge of starvation, so he'll try anything. Even a porcupine is fascinating, but the cat must proceed with caution or he will soon regret this encounter. The leopard tries to bite the porcupine, but the quills become stuck in its mouth. Although the quills are painful, the leopard's hunger is more intense, so the leopard strikes again, this time with more quills poking through the leopard's jaw and body. The leopard kills the porcupine, but dies a few days later from an infection caused by the quills. This is what a leopard that has just finished playing with the porcupine looks like. It may seem trivial, but it's not, because the longer the quills remain stuck in the leopard's body, the higher is the risk of infection. This leopard has managed to kill a porcupine, but looking at the leopard deal with the aftermath, you really must ask yourself if this was really worth it. Unless this leopard is helped and the quills are removed, he may suffer serious consequences. Number 9. Rhino vs. Buffalo Rhinos are significantly larger than buffaloes. A rhino is massive when compared to a bull. The height of a rhino is practically armor, and its horns are significantly more powerful than those of a bull. The rhino would easily defeat a bull because it is significantly more powerful. This rhino isn't wasting any time and slams the buffalo to the ground. When you look at the two culprits, it's clear the buffalo is completely outmatched and will be lucky to survive this fight. This rhino is so agitated by this buffalo, it continues to bash it with its lethal horn until it is knocked out and falls to the ground. The infuriated rhino continues to assault it even when another bull tries to intervene. This rhino is a stubborn creature. I believe the rhino penetrated some of the bull's internal organs, causing him terrible suffering. To complete his dying rituals, the herd gathers around their comrade. These two rhinos and two buffaloes are on a double date, and it doesn't look like they're doing much. It was supposed to be a night out on the town, but I guess the males made up a story so they could be with their girlfriends. Number 8. Birds vs. Tiger If you think a huge tiger is going to scare a goose away, think again. Watch this goose charge this tiger, and the tiger runs back to his mama. He's so scared. It gives all the people watching a good laugh. The tiger walks back towards the goose, trying to figure out what this crazy bird wants. But the goose scares the living daylights out of him a second time, and this time, he gives up. These tigers search for a duck in the water, and they can't seem to find it. They jump after it, but they never manage to get their paws on it. We actually see the ducks swimming in the water at some point, and the tigers are not even close. I think they need to hire a guide if they hope to find this duck. Here is another goose giving a tiger a hard time, but this time, the tiger gets fed up and grabs the goose by the wing. For some reason, I'm not quite sure this goose is going to enjoy her time as much as the goose in our previous clip. I don't know if this is the same goose from the previous clip, just from a different angle. But if it isn't, I guess we can conclude that the white Siberian tigers are afraid of geese. Number 7. Otter vs. Monkey This little monkey and otter are the cutest when they're together. They get along just fine and bathe together. The monkey is all over the otter, and when it swims away, the monkey chases after it. The San Diego Zoo videos shows that otters and monkeys do not get along. Observe as this otter attacks these monkeys who defend and retaliate. I'm not sure why these otters are in the same enclosure if they don't appear to enjoy each other's company. The otter appears to be going back and forth, but nothing else appears to be happening. 
The otters are reinforced, but the small fellas are at a loss for what to do. The monkeys, on the other hand, remain calm and cool while keeping a close eye on the otters. This otter annoys this monkey, and the monkey attempts to grab him. The otter is safe as long as he stays in the water. To be honest, neither of these two appear aggressive, but you never know with wild animals. Our next video shows a fight between a monkey and an otter, but they appear to be play fighting. The otter is lying on the floor, and the monkey is jumping all over the place, but this does not appear to be a serious altercation. It appears that these two are friends who grew up together. Number 6. Zebra vs Wildebeest In the animal kingdom, the wildebeest and the zebra are best friends. The Great Migration attracts over 1.5 million wildebeest and 200,000 zebras each year. Because wildebeest have swarm intelligence, they can avoid dangers along the way, such as crossing a river or traversing open land. Mind you, it doesn't mean they will have any disagreements. We're used to seeing zebras and wildebeest always look like the poor victims when they're being chased by lions. But check out the zebra kick this wildebeest in the head and knock it out cold. I mean, the zebra's kick is subtle. But all the zebras and wildebeest run for their lives when it happens, probably thinking the sound it made was a lion attacking the herd. A zebra decides to go after a young wildebeest calf, but the calf's mother is there to stand guard. However, when a few more zebras jump in, it's not that easy anymore. In the end, the zebras stop the chase and hang out. Wildebeest and zebras are often seen together because they sort of help each other out when it comes to eating. One likes to eat the top end of grass and the other lower end. So when the one that likes the top end has eaten its parts, the other can begin to eat the bottom end. That's quite the partnership. Number 5. Black Widow vs Scorpion Black Widow spiders eat a variety of animals, including scorpions and wood lice. Black Widow spiders are carnivores. They eat anything that has been caught in their web and killed. However, scorpions are not easy to kill, even for the Black Widow, as you will see in the following clips. This scorpion frees itself from a Black Widow's web and retaliates aggressively with a pair of lethal stings to defeat the Black Widow. The scorpion then goes on to hunt the Black Widow. It looks like this scorpion has gotten the better of this Black Widow by chopping off one of its legs. As you can see in these clips, fights between scorpions and Black Widows can go either way. They win some, and they lose some. It looks like this next fight between the two pugilists ends in a stalemate, but both fighters look dead. Are they just resting, or did they commit a double murder? This scorpion is all tangled up in the Black Widow's web, and it's having a hard time untangling itself. Meanwhile, the Widow assaults the scorpion, and not only does it inject its venom into it, but it also rips the scorpion's babies out, and then wraps each baby in its web, I guess prepping them for a late dinner. This scorpion approaches this black widow and seems ready to sting it, but the spider is erratic and quickly moves. When the scorpion is able to grab it, it immediately stings it and injects its venom into the spider, which seems to knock it out cold. I thought black widows also had powerful venom. The scorpion proceeds to eat the spider. At least she will no longer be a widow. This black widow walks in circles in this bowl, but I guess it doesn't have much of a choice because it's round and small. When it approaches the scorpion, the scorpion stings it, and the widow crumbles. Number 4. Gorilla vs Goose First, the crazy goose scared a tiger, and now it decides to scare a gorilla. What is it with these geese terrifying all the animals at the zoo? This time, a happy couple of geese are in the gorilla enclosure, and I'm not sure what effect it has on the gorilla. But one thing is for sure, it makes the big primate run. He's probably excited to see a couple of birds roaming around his enclosure, so he decided to show them his enthusiasm. Number 3. Hen vs Cat You would think a cat would have the edge over a chicken, but it's not the case. Watch this hen take it to this cat and charge him numerous times without a worry in the world. The cat is freaking out, but keeps going back for more. This hen rules. This cat is locked in a wrestling match with the hen, but these two look like they know each other, because when one has the other by a headlock, the other doesn't hurt it. They are definitely friends. This white cat pulls a few moves, but when this rooster goes on the offensive, the cat rolls on his back. I guess the cat figures the rooster is a fierce opponent and is too risky to take on. A chicken comes flying into the frame to attack a cat, but the cat is quick and avoids the attack. Number 2 Crow vs. Rat In this video, it's unclear who is attacking who. 
Is it the crow that landed and attacked the rat? Or is it the rat attempting to cling to the crow? Hmm. I believe the crow is attempting to kill the rat. The crow has the rat restrained, but the rat is biting the crow's beak. A man tries to break up the fight by using a stick to separate the two. This rat is not going down without a fight against this crow. The crow tries several times to grab the rat by the tail and pull on it, but the rat always manages to escape. Finally, the rat has had enough and returns home just in time for a rerun of All in the Family. These two are fighting in a parking lot, and after a few moments of biting and scratching, the crow flies into the bushes while the rat refuses to let go. A woman enters the bush and separates the animals, to the delight of the crowd in the parking lot. Number 1. Swan vs. Dog Swans are no pushovers, and this swan proves it when it attacks a dog that gets close to its family. You can hear the hissing sound the swan makes as well. It almost sounds like a snake. This dog jumps right next to a swan, and not only does he have to deal with the swan, but the swan's partner jumps into the mix as well, so this dog better be careful. This dog wants to go for a swim, but not if the swan has a say. The swan pushes the dog away, and the dog's handler is smart enough to get the dog out of the water before something nasty occurs. This black dog annoys the swan, but the swan retaliates, even if it looks kind of nervous. This dog is playing with the swan, and you can tell the swan is playing along because it doesn't react at all like the other swans we've seen in the previous videos. This is actually a lot of fun to watch, and it's the first time I see a swan having such a good time with a dog, and vice versa. This dog tries to avoid a swan on a dirt road, but at the same time, it's taunting the swan, and the swan is falling for it, taking swings at the dog. The dog's handler is calling him off, but the dog keeps barking at the swan. The handler says the dog just wants to play, but the swan doesn't know that. These were kind of cool, but my favorite has to be the chickens taking it to the cats. That was hilarious. An honorable mention goes to the crazy pit bull that smashed into the buffalo head first. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's our countdown of 15 moments when animals messed with the wrong opponents. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.